Hi, Collective. This is Goddess Nicole Terrell, back to bring you another energetic read for the Collective, for my beautiful and handsome brothers and sisters. Thank you for the continuous support and love for the channel. Thank you so very much for believing in me. I hope that I am delivering messages that you can learn from and that they are useful to you on your journey, okay? With that being said, if you have not subscribed to the channel, make sure you are subscribed to the channel. You don't want to miss any messages. I also have another channel called Karmic Tees, okay? You may find a message over there on that platform. The links are in the description box. You can find them under the description tab, okay? The description tab, if I can get the word out. <laughs> With that being said, guys, uh, I hope you guys are doing fine. Um, I've been up. And I've been up cleaning up because I like to wait till everybody has winded it down, ready for bed or in their bed so I can clean up my house, okay? I like a clean house. So, and there are some days that I just don't do it. And some days I just get in my mood. I can do it at any time of the night, okay? So I was up mopping my floors and washing my dishes. And once I sat down and got finished and stuff, I... I did my sage. I put my salt down and stuff like that. Um, so some of you guys are doing cleansing at night. Some of you guys are like me. You like to cleanse at night when everybody has wind down, okay? And I was sitting here at my desk and I got a download. Somebody feels um, dirty, maybe filthy even, or even disgusted at the way they treated you, Okay. This is an individual from the past that do not looking at do not like looking at themselves in the mirror. They do not fix like fixing themselves. Okay, this could be a masculine energy or a feminine energy. Take the energy as it resonates with you. Okay, not all these stories are specifically for you. Okay, just uh, eat the meat and spit out the bones. Okay, what I was saying is um, when I got the download, I was like, wow. Spirit, do I need to take a bath or what? What are you trying to say when I? What are you trying to say now? Cause I'm in, I am cleaning up my house now. And he was like, No, someone feels this way. So somebody in your past collective is feeling real shitty right about now. Excuse my language, but they are okay. They cannot even look at themselves. Like I said, this person cannot even face themselves. This person is coward. Okay, they can't even face you to give you some type of closure or an apology to say that I'm wrong. I was I was wrong for treating you this way. I was wrong for treating you and the kids this way. If you had kids with this person, only take what resonates with you. This person is facing a lot of anguish right now. Anguish. I hear anguish. This person is going through uh, a terrible fall, fall. I mean, from grace, okay? They're receiving a lot of karma. It's like it's back to back. It's like a domino effect, back to back. It's it's like if you, this person is seeing like, <clears throat> once they clear out a, a, another path, another path opens up to destruction. That's what I got. So, and this person is also, guys, um, shocked at your healing and growth, okay? I hear, I heard healing and growth uh, they are so shocked at the new you, okay? This person is watching, okay? They're keeping a close eye on you. Even if they can't see you, do, if you have these people blocked or this person, um, they are in contact with somebody that is close to you. They're receiving some type of information here or some type of um, message or a call or a phone call or whatever. Somebody is instructing this person with information, okay? I got coward. This person is nervous. I also got... Uh, this person could be jealous of your growth and your glow up, okay? How you heal so perfectly, okay? They are in shock. I don't know why this person could be in shock because if this person was to face their demons, okay, they can heal just like you can, collective, my beautiful uh, brothers and sisters. They can they can heal just like you if this person put in the work. 
I don't think this person is willing to do that. I don't think this person is really ready to change. This is what it's giving me by this dialogue. Yeah, they should be filthy. They should feel disgusted. They should feel dirty because you don't treat people wrong. You treat people how you're supposed to be treated. I don't think this person was taught that, okay? They didn't have a perfect role model. I think this person is uh, troubled by uh, childhood wounds or trauma, something here, okay? Or this person just chose to go down this path on their own, okay? This person may have had um, influential people, people in their life, influence, influential people in their life. Excuse me, guys. But this person chose to go down the other path. And then they met you. Somebody was a sweet-natured person. Very loving. Very, um... You used your heart when it came to this person. And I think you genuinely love this person. And they just rip your heart to shreds. I heard that. Wow. This person did not treat you guys good at all. And I think that is what is eating this person alive. This is why this person feels dirty, okay? This person feels filthy, okay? This person is disgusted with the way they treated you. And it's eating them up from the inside. It's like, it's like a disease that they can't get rid of, okay? They feel like they got to get back to you to make things right. I think that's what I heard. To make things right. And I don't know if you guys see this person different. You could be. It could come out in the cards. Um, you're not talking to this person. You're separating. You're not in contact with them. Okay. Um, matter of fact, um, it's been a while for some of you guys. Okay. Let's get some tarot on this. Okay. Spirit, what about this download? About this person feels filthy and disgusted here about my collective, the way they treated them. Yeah, nine of swords. In the reverse, you let this person go, okay? You moved on from them, okay? You ended up this uh, karmic cycle with this person, okay? Because that's what it was, a karmic cycle, okay? The Nine of Swords speaks of an end of a crisis. I think you guys was in crisis when you was in a relationship with this person. Okay? You could have been stressed up all night, worried, suffering. I feel like you, for some of you guys, y'all could have suffered in silence. Okay? When it pertains to this person. Okay? For some of you guys, you did. You was worried all the time with this person. Mm-hmm. Strength in the reverse. Yeah. This person is not so strong now. They're in this nine of swords energy, but in the upright. Okay. The strength in the reverse talks about being weak. Weak willed. Weak spirit. Weak soul. Okay. Not strong at all. Okay. It talks about internal conflict. And this is what this person is feeling. They're feeling filth. They're feeling dirty, okay? Disgusted in themselves, okay? This is what it's giving me with the strength in the reverse here. Six of Pentacles, yeah. They didn't give and receive to you properly, okay? They could have gave and received to other things outside of you guys' relationship or outside of you guys' connection. With the Six of Pentacles, they were generally generous with other individuals, but they were not generous with you, Okay? They could have had a loving spirit for other things that suited them. This person could have been selfish, narcissistic. Okay, that's what I'm picking up to as well. They gave to other things here. I think they just took from you and, and give it and gave it away. I just felt like that. I just feel like that. They took from you and gave it to somebody else. <gasps> we got the uh, four of swords here in the reverse. This is somebody that needs to um, take accountability. It talks about self-care. It talks, it talks about resting. Okay? This is all this person does is rest. Okay? 
four of wands in the reverse. I'm tired. I, I thought that was the four of swords. I'm sorry, y'all. Four of wands in the reverse. So, yeah, it broke up. Somebody needs to rest. This union broke up. Y'all broke this union. This this was, this was is what this person feels sad about. Because now this person could be facing in conflict or instability here. When you guys were in this, this is why you let this go. Because that's what you guys were facing here. I thought that was the four of swords. Excuse me. But this person could be lying somewhere thinking about you guys. Four of pentacles here. I think you're holding back here. Or this person is holding back for coming in because that's why they're so weak here. They're holding this back and they know they need to release this, okay? This is what's got this person feeling all in their head and stuck. With the four, so four of pentacles, they could be going through some type of strike too. Financial strike. Mm-hmm. It speaks of uh, greed, too, and control, because this is somebody that, with the strength in the upright, this is it's giving me leadership. It's giving me somebody that is strong-willed, strong-minded. This person could have been controlling, okay? Greedy. Yeah, six of wands. You are seeing in high honor to this person, okay? This person could um could want attention from the public, okay? They could um thrive off of being generous to the public instead of being generous in a connection, okay? With the six of wands to the I mean six of pentacles to the six of wands, I just feel like. This person thrive off of public attention. They didn't they didn't care about their relationship here. Okay. This person could be seen in the public eye too as well. Or you can now. Judgment. They are on a heavy judgment here. And this is why this person feels this way. What else here, spirit? Two of cups. Yeah, this relationship has came to an end for some of you guys it's it's over or if they're in a relationship now it's over they're facing some type of karma here okay this person was a snake to you with the seven of swords here you are the star here so yeah you definitely seen in the public here and this is why they're they feel like they got to come back and make it right they don't want you to move forward without giving you some type of healing here with the star here. I figured like you guys have already moved on, but energetically this person is holding on with the eight of cups in the reverse. Okay. They're in some type of regret and stagnation too. They're avoiding you because you are so healing. Okay. You done healed here. Okay. You done mastered that shit. For some of you guys, you're spreading healing in the public too. You helping others here with the Six of Wands. Okay? Nine of Cups. Yeah, you definitely... It's wish fulfillment to this person. Okay? But they feel like they're stuck. They, they, they can't remove themselves. Okay? Feeling trapped here. I think it's more in their head and energetically, energetically too. Maybe spiritual. They wanted to keep you binded to them. This is why the Eight of Cups is in the reverse. Knight of Pentacles. They could have lost a job. They feel like they don't have much to offer if they did come back and say something to you because you're so successful here. Some of you guys are very successful. Um, this person could feel like they're going to waste their time here. If they come back, yeah, Eight of Pentacles. What did I say? Y'all are working really hard here. Very steadfast. You're, you're successful in your craft, okay? You know what you're working towards, your goals here, your aspirations, all the above here. Your manifestations are coming in. You're working real hard here. And I don't think this person, I don't know. Yeah, it's a secret here for some of you guys with the moon energy here. They fearful. That's why I say this person is a coward. Very childlike. 
if this is adult, this person still acts like a child. They haven't grew up yet. They lack the emotional uh, maturity here, okay? This also could be somebody that um, is trying to manifest you back here with the moon energy. This person could also be uh, up under some type of illusions here. They definitely want to communicate, but they're in and out. They're back and forth here. I said that. They want to communicate. <clears throat> eight, eight, eight could be significant here. Okay. You could be very abundant, and this person knows that. Mm hmm. Empress, I could be speaking to you, honey. This could be your uh, masculine from your past, a masculine from your past here, honey. Okay. They're trying to manifest you under this moon. Okay. <laughs> I hear howling at the moon, child. Talking to the moon. That's what this person is doing. They're trying to manifest this uh, Ten of Pentacles into their life, too, because they financially strapped, too. You are the abundance. You are the one that carry the uh, master manifest. You are the master manifest. You can manifest things. This person knows that. Wow. They let a gem get away here. This is what it's giving me. Wow. The Empress, you let that got away? Six of Cups, somebody from your past that's facing a lot, a lot, a lot of delays and obstacles, okay? This person is financially strapped. They're going through some type of strike. They're going through karma. I'm telling you. Spirit, one more here to crown it all. Then we'll get something else here, guys. Ace of Cups, but they still love you. Empress. This person fucked up really bad, whoever this is, really bad. Yeah, King of Cups, I can't make it up. Spirit won't allow me. This is somebody who cheats. This is somebody that could be bitter. They also can do a little hocus pocus, okay, magic, okay. The King of Cups in the reverse could definitely be somebody who is not a leader okay they're very insecure they're very defensive very frustrated okay <clears throat> this is somebody who is very disrespectful they can be very um emotional immature okay emotionally unstable they don't have their emotions in check okay yeah this is somebody that lied a lot but something is truthful is coming out about this person Okay, they're starting to be more vulnerable here. Okay, because they know they love you here, Empress. This is somebody that could be stuck on past, on the past with you guys with the Six of Cups in the reverse here. They don't know how to let things go. They don't know how to control their emotions here. This is somebody who is unemotionally intelligent. Okay. Wow. All the above here. What is this person wants to say, Spirit? I mean, I mean, come on here. I mean, <laughs> this is crazy. Craziness. Let's see. Love affair. Yeah, this is somebody who cheats. Okay. This could be somebody that's on the download that likes the same sex too as well. The dirty little secret here. I'm just pitching it that this is why this person feels filthy. This is why this person feels dirty. Okay. All right. <laughs> Let's see. This is why they feel disgusted because they're recalling. Uh, memories of you guys. It says reminiscing memories returning. They want to return so bad, but they are not a king here. At best, they could be the Knight of Pentacles in the reverse here. Okay. Yeah. They miss the happy times with you guys. Okay. I think you touched this person's heart. That's why the Ace of Cups is out here. Okay. For some of you guys, this person really loves you. You bring them joy. Okay. 
They know you are the master manifester here. You br you bring things and you build people up here. You're very creative. You're uh you're blocked. You're not blocked here. Yeah, with crickets coming out on the side, they are indecisive. This person is very indecisive. They don't know if they want to say something or stay silent. Okay, this is what it's giving me with the silence on the side here with non-action. They're not taking any action towards you. They don't know. <laughs> yeah, with seats, receipts here, there could be some proof about this person. Sexual, sexual pays here, okay, with the King of Cups, they can be very sexual here. They can overdo sex, to be honest. <laughs> yeah, somebody got proof that they was cheating on you here, could be. Somebody could want to tell you that, meet up with you and explain to you, okay? Where two or more people discussed or planning, they're planning to tell you about this love affair that they had you in, they were sneaky. And this is somebody that was fake pretending, living above their means here. They could flash like they got money, but underneath this person is broke. This is not a fucking leader here. Yeah, this person is karmic. I can't make it up. Third party relationship lesson. This person could also put you in the third party with a karmic too as well. Somebody that likes to do what they do, okay? But you are protected by this person from coming in. This is why this person know. This is why the silence is on the side here. Because they know how protected you are. How healed you are. They're actually shocked about how you done healed and grew yourself, okay? This is why this person is... And this karmic energy because they already know you're not going to tolerate that. You're not fucking with the, no karmic energy. Nobody is not going back through no karmic cycles. Especially the Empress. They're going to have to come better than the motherfucking King of Cups in the reverse. That's just period. <laughs> yeah. It's a timing factor here. With timing factor, they on pause. Archangel I, Michael out here in the universe is protecting you from this person. They got this person in time out with Paul's and time and factor here. They already know what's up. They know this person hasn't healed. This person is karmic. You done learned your karmic lesson from this person because they were fake. They had you in third parties and love affairs, triangles, all that shit. Yeah, they're running. Okay? They're avoiding you. Because they are coward. They can't face what the fuck they did for you. And that's why they feel disgust here. They feel disgusted. Yeah. You're not weighed down. You're not anchored by this person anymore. I think your heart is closed off to this person. And they feel that. They definitely do. Yeah, they're crushed by it too. They're heartbroken. It says sad, broken, feeling alone. This is what this King of Cups is. I'm telling you, when you out here being a hoe, you know, being in everybody else's bed, you have like a sex demon on you. You are karmic. And at the end of the night, you all alone and feel used and abused. This is what this person is at. They feel broken. They feel filthy, nasty, dirty. And they know they can't come back to you like that. <laughs> No, they, they got to face the truth. This person is not facing the truth. They're irrational. They're unreasonable. <laughs> Karmic. What else here, spirit? <sighs> yeah, this is a definitely a forbidden love. And you're like, bye, I ain't got time. This is a karmic masculine energy from your past here that is watching you, okay? And projecting all of that shit on you, okay? They want to come back. But they're blocked here by Archangel Michael here. Protection, divine intervention. This is prevented from any harm. Spirit knows this person is a liar. Like I said, this person is watching you. I can't make this shit up. This person is focused, laser focused on you guys. If they're, uh, if you're posting something here on social media, this person be the first to watch. Okay, they're fascinated by you. How your growth um, has turned you out to be so so perfect here. Have you changed? Okay, you're not taking any shit from anybody. Not alone, this person. Yeah, they're trying to, you know, you scream. I think some of you guys cut this person off extremely and blocked them out of your energy. For some of you guys, you were receiving messages from your archangels here, okay? Especially, specifically, Archangel Michael to tell you to move on from this person because they were into, you saw some harsh things here. 
Okay? Yeah. <laughs> All they know, this person may want to come trap you, entrap you. This is why you're being blocked. It says pregnancy, money, heartstrings. This person may try to come back and play a trickster on you. Try to tug on your heartstrings to get you pre pregnant to keep you stuck and trapped to them. Okay, some of you guys are balling here. You're very abundant. All this person wants you to do is take care of them with money uh, under uh, pregnancy here. The Archangel Mike and them know what's up. <laughs> yep. They feel like a motherfucking crown, a clown, embarrassed. And for some of you, this person's appearance has done change drastically. This person, you may not even recognize them no more for all the shit that they do. They run in their body in the ground. This person may use substances, okay, to keep them in their feelings. Whatever they do to calm their nerves or calm, or calm their mind here, okay, they overindulge here with the King of Cups. They drinking themselves to death here. Yeah, time has ran out with TikTok here. And I'm going to end it there, guys. I really hope this, uh, hope this you know, you recognize some of these, um, this energy here. Hope you resonated with it too as well because I tell you, people get themselves in this situation like this and they always want to motherfucking come back after you done healed okay you done healed from this traumatic experience with this karmic here for some of you guys it was really extremely hard to get over this healing to keep this person out of your heart i just feel that i hope this helps someone this has been goddess nicole tarot peace love and light to you collective until next time Mwah. Bye. I stay safe and I love you guys.